Hello everybody, my name is Jarl Chris and welcome back to a new video. Today I am doing another Skyrim Creation Club mod review and today I'm going to be reviewing the Rising Dead Creation Club mod. So you start this one off by you receive a letter once you reach a certain level I believe. I, I'm well past that but I still have the letter in my inventory and I haven't read it yet so let's get into this. Started the Rising Dead. Someone, please help. A group of necromancers are experimenting with conjuring zombies using ancient, dangerous magic, which I fear will have unintended and irreversible consequences. I was expelled from their studies as their ambitions grew into folly against my warnings. They're performing a ritual to summon a large group of these foul, uncontrollable creatures as we speak into the southernmost areas of Skyrim, and must be stopped before it's too late. Alright, so let's see where this takes us. Well, it'll probably... Oh, I do have it activated. So it takes us right over there. Alright, I'm going to read the quest in my quest book, and then I'm going to head over there, and I'll cut to when I'm there. The Rising Dead. I received an, I have received an anonymous letter asking me to help us stop a group of necromancers who are planning to raise an army of zombies. I should investigate the ritual site. Alright, so I'll see you guys there. Alright, so it seems we have arrived at our location, or almost so, so let's head on right over here to the quest marker and see what's going on. Now I know that has nothing to do with it. Okay, so it seems we have some zombies. It seem just like retextured Draugr. Let's take all these guys out. There's quite a lot of them. The putrid zombies seem quite a bit tougher. There's someone shooting magic at me too. Although, yep, yeah, that's the spell sword from the other location. Hmm, thanks, some um, Gog. So yeah, these just seem like another recreation of Mort's from... What is this? Oh, so he can conjure Storm Atronachs. That's cool. But like I was saying, they just seem to be a... reincarnation of the zombies from Oblivion. Here we have a necromage. We have his journal. This is a shorter one, so I'll read it. Third of Sun's Height, Fourth Era, Year 201. An apprentice of mine recently discovered an ancient tome in a forgotten cavern during a gathering expedition. This tome is like nothing I've seen in a very long time. I believe it is a conjuration spell of some sort, but I can't be certain. I'll need to spend some time deciphering this. It could be quite valuable to us. 18th of Sun Height, 4th Era, Year 201. I spent the last several weeks working tirelessly to decipher this ancient tome. It's just as I suspected. It is indeed a conjuration spell, however the creature summoned is especially vicious. An undead zombie of wonderfully putrid potency that appears to be much more active in the late, hours, late night hours. I'm not stopping now. I plan to create an even more powerful version of this spell. As Molog Ball is my witness, I shall have a zombie horde at my command before long. 15th of Last Seed, 4th Era, 201. Nothing could have prepared me for the power I am about to wield. The whole of my training has been for this moment. Soon my apprentice, apprentices and I shall perform a ritual of the likes of which has not been seen in centuries, and bring forth an undead army powerful and willing to do my bidding. Its power will radiate across Skyrim, bringing forth waves of undead from the darkness. The time is at hand. So it seems that we just have some psycho necromage who wants to conjure all these zombies. And there is some spell tomes, so we can do so. Let's go ahead and read these and then check it out. So in one hand we have the normal zombie 
I'm gonna assume it spawns with a random weapon. And in our left hand, the foul zombie, which I'd assume is just a stronger version of the original zombie. And what I do know of this is that after you complete this, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry. After you complete this, if you're wandering around at night, there is a chance for a random encounter of like a zombie attack sort of thing. So, overall, yet another short one. I just finished recording the goblin one before this, which will come out before. But it's just another short, interesting, quirky one. And so, I'll give it like a 5 out of 10. I find zombies less interesting than goblins. So, other than that, it was pretty interesting. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe for more. Leave a comment down below for what you want me to do next. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Hello, everybody. My name is Jarl Chris, and you just finished watching one of my videos. Obviously, if you made it this far, you probably enjoyed it. So if you did, leave a like and subscribe for more. Leave a comment down below if you have any advice for me or if you want to see something else and you need to tell me. Other than that, hope you have a nice rest of your day. See you again. Bye-bye.